vehicles. In fact, let me just tell you, there was a gentleman over in the United Kingdom and they called him the Grumpy Gardener. Now we've kind of renamed him the Grouchy Gardener, but he loved gardening, but he didn't have the right tools. So he started making his own tools and this one is very, very popular. It's the top gardening brand at QVC UK. And this is his weeding tool called the Cultimate. I like that. And Michelle Stretch is here to tell Hi. us all about it because the grouchy gardener is still over in the UK. Um, how are you? Hi. It's, <laughs> it's good great to see, to see you. you. Yeah, you and too. I'm so happy that he was grouchy. Now we can all benefit from that. It's well, you were telling tool. me it is your favorite tool. It is. And can I just show you too? These are some of the things that you can replace. So oh, with wow. this, you can do you know you can do digging you can do weeding you can do edging you can do cultivating you can plant your seeds your bulbs all of that so instead of having all of this in your drawer wow. this is the one thing that I like to have in my drawer um, basically I can do about 95 percent of my gardening wow. with, this. with that and by the way we have three colors yes. green red or blue and I also want to mention to this to you this is customer top rated as well just like those last uh, uh, wall art pieces customers order it and then you can go back on qvc.com and you can actually write a review and if you give it a certain amount of stars five being perfect if it has four and a half to five stars and more than 10 reviews it's customer top rated so it means our customers truly do love it and thank you and I would definitely rate it that way myself I am yeah. you know somebody that loves this just real quick I want to show you from yeah. top to bottom so at the very top we have this little point it's almost the size of a bay leaf mm -hmm. Mary Beth so and you have all the pressure coming through there when you're gardening I love the shape of the design here and this is steel and it's injection molded all the way into the handle so nothing's going to break off at the top here we have a little kind of a knob right there for your thumb and your fingers you can use this right-handed you can also use it left-handed so the lefties can't get I out of gardening <laughs> okay flat edges here so you can rake as well and wow. super I mean tell I'm telling you I've had mine for five years and yeah. it's super sturdy wow. and strong uh, by the way Joni from face on, on QVC's Facebook page says good morning loving the pieces I'm with you Joni I feel like I want to buy just about everything in the show these make such good sense we've had practical items and we've had beautiful items items but let's talk and maybe if someone's kind of a novice gardener how would they use this you know what so what I was just doing there sometimes when you pull these out pull your plants out of the plastic or the flat yeah you need to be able to scrape the edges kind of like a butter knife there so yeah. I easily did that with this and then you could just dig out here and then plant tamp it down so you can very easily replant your yeah. your potted plants your right. garden items there mm -hmm. this is the most fun too do you want to try some weeding Absolutely. over here so, so just the flick of the wrist. Okay. Yeah, and you could just get down yeah. there and get the tap roots out. That's Ooh. what you want to do. So all those dandelions. I know, and they are you know? coming. You know, I That's love right. gardening season is coming, but also the weeds are coming as well. That's so, nice because it can get down underneath the roots. Yes. And then you lift it up like lift that. Lift it up easily. Um, and here I just changed my wrist um, position my oh. best. So if you are digging up rocks, I have a brick under here. Oh but if you're goodness. getting some garden fatigue, you can switch that around right there. Yeah. It's all about precision gardening really That's amazing and then like you say when you want to go ahead and make a hole to plant something you can do that or to plant seeds you could like you said to me earlier you can do your trough you know, it's to put the seeds in and then cover it up. It really is a multi-use tool. And it's a great edger too. I found that and I found, you know, it was such a wonderful surprise to me how great this is at edging. It what do you mean by edging? Edging like around your mulch beds. If you have mulch and then it meets up with the grass. Yes. The edging, right. it gives you a really nice, precise, clean. precise, clean yeah. edge. And you're not wrecking your plants either. You're coming in here with precision gardening and you can go around there just very gently. Here's Here's a picture of the before and after <laughs> of the garden. edging. That's my that's garden. That's garden? And that's what I discovered wow. that day when I had these messy edges here at the beginning of the season. Yeah. I went in there in a matter of a couple of minutes. I had that beautiful edge there. Wow. So I could do it myself instead of hiring a gardener to do that. That's amazing. Here's this my house. before and after. <laughs> That's your house that again. Is, that was about a few minutes of work right there, just grabbing those weeds and cleaning that up. Wow. So it's so easy to get in there. It's just a great handle.
hand tool that you could do about a 12 inches long. It's like an yeah. extension of your arm. It's like a it's like a claw. It really that you have <laughs> on your hand. It really is. Oh my goodness. Wow, that is so neat. I've never seen this before, and it's from the Grouchy Gardener. And I think it's so cute. It's called the seven in one cultivate weeding tool. And it's because it, it actually replaces all these different things. I've even lost a couple of things. <laughs> um, I'll put them back on again because the key here is, you know, it's less tools to actually keep in your garage as well. It really is. So, and look nice at this. colors too, Mary Beth. So if you want to, you know, if you're like me, you throw the tools in the yard when you're yeah. when you're finished gardening, you go to get a glass of water, you can easily find them. It. This but, is the stuff that you're replacing. Yeah, you don't need that spade, you don't need that digger, all those different things, or to cut the hole. It will do it right here with this tool. Super and strong. Remember, these are really affordable. $17.75. You know how we spend a $20 bill for, you know, just about anything? <laughs> this isn't even a $20 bill. Um, three easy payments of $5.92. And um, we had those before and afters. We'll show you again. Here's some video that's showing you getting those weeds out, and even out of the, the mulch or the rock. Don't they grow everywhere? Oh, I mean, they, they, any little crack you can find, you can just find those weeds there and this will scrape them out. Like what about between pavers or something like this that? This works perfectly for that. That nice little flat edge, it is steel and it's powder coated yeah. steel, injection molded and they don't rust. I've left mine outside as well. Wow. So you, there it is. There oh, it, yeah. between the pavers, if you have the dirt in there, if mm -hmm. you have, you know, the weeds that grow up in there, very easy and precise. Here it is, you can plant too with this. I mean, you just grab this one tool and you wow. can, you know, maybe the other, the one other thing you might need, Mary Beth, is maybe the shears. Yeah. When you want to prune. Okay. But those two tools, this is wow. great for practically everything Anything. in your garden. And she's a great gardener, Michelle is, so she knows what she's talking about. And we've just planted these different plants, but once again, if you in fact have that icky weed right there, I'm gonna just show you, obviously <laughs> I've already pulled it out, but um, maybe I'll plant the weed. <laughs> that sounds weird, doesn't it? Um, but anyway, <laughs> assume that weed is growing in my garden. There you go. You can just get under it because the it goes down. The tap root needs to come out, Mary Beth. That's, and that's right. the nice shape of this design specifically <laughs> to get the weeds out so you're not cultivating and, and spreading those weeds. That's right, exactly. And don't tell anybody I was planting weeds. <laughs> anyway, I'll just tell you that. In the meantime, it's M65469. And a couple of quick uh, reminders of something that we had in the hour. One of which is that